You know, this time of the year, an ice cold smoothie sure does hit the spot, and we are glad to welcome Lacey Horn, the owner of Tropical Smoothie Cafe in Kingsport, to the daytime kitchen. How you doing, Lacey? Doing well. Thanks for having me. Oh, thanks for being here. Let's talk about let's talk about your cafe first. Tell us more about Tropical Smoothie Cafe. Well, Tropical Smoothie opened in Florida in about 1997, and right. since then we've grown to about 16, 1,600 cafes wow. nationwide. Yeah, so we've about doubled in the past three years since I've been a franchisee. Yeah. Talk to us about why you decided to, to, to get on board with Tropical Smoothie. We've well, been a nurse for about 20 years and I wanted right. something different. I wanted a way to give back to my community in a different way. So I do right. try to sponsor every team, especially in the Johnson City community. Right. Um, I try to give back to the Crumley House, to St. Jude's, any way oh, I can. Man. So I do try to I just want to be charitable and this is I've lived here my whole life and yeah. it's it's a passion of mine to be charitable. Talk to me about what a typical day is like for you at the cafe. Well, Monday through Friday, we open at 7 a.m. for breakfast. The brand has done a wonderful job uh -huh. of um, giving more breakfast items. We have three breakfast wraps. We have a sausage and egg quesadilla. Oh, wow. Um, and here lately, we've gotten smoothie bowls, which I'm super excited about. We're going to talk about those a little bit later. Yes, sir. How those been doing. I mean, fantastic. Our good. acai bowl has sold yes. well, and we have um, a chia oatmeal bowl that has been hit numbers that I never thought would do. People are really enjoying it. All right. We'll talk more about those uh, those smoothie bowls coming up in just a little while. Now, you're going to make a smoothie for I us. Am. Now, which smoothie are you making for I'm us? I'm making today? the Bahama Mama, which is probably my personal favorite and okay. probably my best seller. It's best seller. Okay. Best seller. So best what seller. goes in? Best seller. Okay. So we've got our um, strawberries. All right. This, that's that, this time of year, strawberries. Strawberries, yes. yes. Pineapple. Oh, love it. Yep. Coconut. Coconut. Mm -hmm. All right. We've got some Ghirardelli white chocolate. Oh. Powdered mm -hmm. form, yeah. You got turbinado, and if you'd like to save on a little bit of calories, you can yeah. always sub with Splenda or take okay. it out completely. Most of our smoothies stand just fine alone. That turbinado is kind of like raw sugar. It is raw sugar. Yeah, that's Very great. Very minimally processed. Yes. yes. Some ice in gotta here. Got to have some ice in Absolutely. here. Absolutely. How would you, how many, you know, during an average week, how many smoothies do you think y'all do? An average week, we probably sell about 500 per day. So right. I would venture to say 3,500 a week. All right, now this yeah. is your smoothie machine here. This is my smoothie. This is the Vitamix Quiet one. Okay. Um, May not be too, too quiet. <laughs> We're going to find out here. There we go. Yep. Now, how long do you let those blend? When you um, usually about 30 seconds. We usually can get smoothies out within about two minutes. You weren't you were kidding. That is a turbo. That thing is really taking off. Yeah. Yeah, about 30 seconds and it's good. It's good. Well, yeah. yeah. We've got just a few more seconds, but yeah, okay. it's, it's just about really good. Now, what is this process here? It's kind of slowing down. And, and well, what sure they'll do, if our ice was super, super cold, right. we wouldn't have to do so much. But right. Yeah. But yeah, we're just going to blend right here. And pour. All right. Yeah. Look at that. Yes. It's like you've done this a time or two. It just feels a, the perfect, just, just perfect a, cup. Just a few, sir. All right. And right here, we can offer also edible straws. We oh. have our strawberry and our lime. I would recommend An edible, doing the strawberry. Yeah, I would recommend doing the strawberry okay. with this smoothie. An edible straw. Yes, sir. I've never seen the like. Yeah. <laughs> and that goes right in. Yes, sir. All right. Can I give it a Absolutely. little quality control? Absolutely. Okay. Mm. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's my favorite. And you can oh. add whey protein, pea protein, collagen, multivitamin, right. probiotic, vitamin immune complex. And when folks come in, what is they can come in and kind of come up with their own blend too. Can we you? can. We can also we can modify just about any base recipe that we have. We have right. so many people who add everything. <laughs> I have one person who orders every single supplement, whey protein, double whey protein, especially after the gym. Now you said supplement. What kind of supplements do you have there? Um, we have probiotic, multivitamin, vitamin C complex, collagen. We right. do a fat burner, energizer. Okay. Um, I would say our probably our most high protein smoothies are peanut paradise. Okay. And it has about 37 grams of protein. So for a lot of folks that are doing maybe a keto or something like that, that's a great way to go. It is. And you can also, that smoothie has um, our turbinado in it, but you can sub that for Splenda or take it completely out and it'll save you about 220 calories. All right, Lacey, we're going to come back here in just a few months. She did this wonderful smoothie. I cannot wait to see the smoothie bowl. Thank you. All right, Lacey Horn there with Tropical Smoothie Cafe in Kingsport. If you'd like to go by, it's located right there on Eastman Road. The Johnson City location is right there on North Rhone Street. If you want to learn more, go to tropicalsmoothiecafe.com.